There are many species that are on the edge of extinction, usually due to humans, and many that may never recover. For this video, I have chosen five of the most critically endangered animals according to WWF, and I will talk about each one and why they are so threatened. Here are the five most critically endangered animals. Number one, the mountain gorilla. The mountain gorilla, a subspecies of the eastern gorilla, mostly lives in the Virunga Mountains, an extinct volcano range. This range lies between the countries of the Democratic Republic of the Congo, Rwanda and Uganda. Mountain gorillas are well adapted to life at high altitudes, with more fur than other gorillas, protecting them from the sometimes below freezing temperatures. This animal, however, is incredibly endangered, with an estimated 880 individuals remaining, as of September 2015. This is due to humans moving into the animal's territory, and forcing them to move up to even higher altitudes, where the conditions are dangerous. Gorillas that come into contact with humans can also get diseases that they are not immune to, and have been known to die from the common cold. Mountain gorillas are also often caught in traps set for other animals by hunters. Fortunately, conservation efforts have increased the number of mountain gorillas from about 620 in 1989 to the current number of almost 900. Number 2. The Sumatran Tiger This incredibly rare subspecies of tiger only lives on the island of Sumatra in Indonesia, and an estimated 400 individuals remain. Sumatran tigers are the smallest of the living tiger subspecies, measuring a maximum length of 2.55 metres long. Poaching tigers is strictly against the law in Sumatra, and in all of Asia, however there is still high demand for tiger parts. Sumatran tigers are losing their habitat quickly due to illegal timber harvesting, and clearing for agriculture and settlement. Although many efforts have been made to reduce the number of animals killed by poachers, this illegal hunting still continues on Sumatra, and does not appear to have reduced at all since the 1990s. Another problem for Sumatran tigers is human interaction, as these animals are forced by habitat loss closer to settlements, which can result in both humans and tigers being killed. Number 3. The Vaquita Vaquitas are the rarest marine mammals in the world, with an estimated population of fewer than 100. These animals are a species of porpoise that was relatively recently discovered in 1958, and only live in the northern Gulf of California. Vaquitas have dark rings around their eyes and dark coloration on their lips that form a line to the pectoral fins. Over half of the population of this animal have been killed in the last three years, mainly due to being caught and drowned in gill nets used by legal fishers in protected areas of sea. It is thought that one in every five vaquitas are killed this way. These porpoises will likely be extinct by 2018 unless the Mexican government enforces a complete ban on gillnet fishing, which WWF is requesting. Number 4. The Amur Leopard This rare subspecies of leopard lives in the far east of Russia, and has adapted to be able to live in the temperate forests of the area. It is also called the Manchurian Leopard or the Korean Leopard, and usually lives alone, although males have been known to help females raise their cubs for a while. The Amur Leopard is threatened greatly by poaching, as hunters target it for its incredible spotted fur. The forests that these animals live in are easily accessed by poachers, as villages and houses are built very close to them, meaning that people can hunt Amur Leopards and their prey with little difficulty. There are not enough prey animals to support large populations of Amur Leopards, but if restrictions are put on poaching, it is possible for the numbers to recover, which would in turn help Amur Leopards. Fortunately, this animal's population has more than doubled in recent years, from only 30 individuals in 2007 to now over 60, due to successful conservation work. Number 5. The Javan Rhino The Javan Rhino is the most threatened species of rhino, with only 60 animals surviving in Java, in Indonesia. The Javan Rhino is grey in colour and has a single horn, smaller than other rhino species. This animal used to live in much of southern Asia, but is now confined just to the western tip of Java in the Ujung Kulon National Park. Javan rhinos were made critically endangered mainly by hunting during colonial times for their horn and as pests, but are also threatened by other things. Almost half of the national park that they live in has been taken over by Orangapan, which is an invasive species that causes the rhinos to lose the plants they feed on. The park is also at risk from tsunamis and volcanic eruptions that can potentially wipe out the last of the Javan rhinos. As well as this, four individuals have died due to disease passed from cattle, and the extremely low numbers of remaining animals mean that there is little genetic diversity, a huge problem if the species is to recover. 
Luckily, WWF and others are developing a program to move some of these animals to other locations in Indonesia, which will help with diversifying the species, reduce the risk of extinction due to natural disasters, and create a new population. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and are now more aware of these vulnerable species. I'd like to encourage you to support organisations such as WWF that are doing incredible work to protect these animals, and I hope you will do what you can to help save them before it's too late.